Okay. <laughs> Hello, I'm uh, Farkas Rusko. Uh, I'm uh, experienced in uh, high voltage uh, and high frequency uh, electronics. So I have uh, George Agari to uh, build uh, a cold fusion uh, dust uh, reactor. You mentioned, mm -hmm. is it correct? Uh, this is uh, the device uh, inside. So first, it's it's a it's a simple one uh, for uh, reliable uh, working. So you can see uh, microwave uh, transformers like modes uh, in series. So it's uh, produced uh, two thousand and uh, one hundred voltage per piece. So the result is. 4200 in series and uh, you cannot see the rectifier the, the full wave rectifier in that other side uh, uh, it's uh, uh, 1 kilovolt 3 amps uh, uh, 16 in series per leg so it's rectifies the high voltage and uh, two microwave oven capacitors which one microfarad per piece uh, filtering the high voltage DC and supply the magnetron it's very important to cool the magnetron properly so it's uh, an air uh, channel and uh, quite quite a strong uh, fan in two of them one uh, blows and one uh, sucks out mm -hmm. the uh, hot air from mm -hmm. the magnetron and it's a precise uh, SCR control uh, 16 uh, amperes so it's a little bit uh, overkill but it's required for the inductive uh, loads the rectifiers are there at the back of the box assembled uh, and over here uh, here's one of the boards so how are you doing this okay can i describe yeah uh, so this is the uh, one rectifier modules, uh, 16 diodes in uh, series, and the other side, it's a one one mags uh, resistors, mm -hmm. high. Uh, uh, it's a bigger one, not for the power, but the voltage. Avoid arcing uh, mm -hmm. between the, the diodes. So this is one leg. Uh, it's much more simple to build than uh, by uh, microwave diodes which are only just uh, 0 0.2 amperes by 16 kilowatts about mm -hmm. 12 16 kilowatts it's it's uh, much uh, uh, more uh, amperes can handle and also makes the system more reliable uh, one more important thing it's a transformer it's a low voltage uh, transformer with, but with very special uh, secondary it's a reinforced uh, insulation here the red one which is a silicon uh, based cable the secondary ma made from it and it can handle seven and a half uh, kilovolt AC uh, between the secondary and uh, the primary from the mains voltage it it it's 
not need to handle too much power about 20 watts for uh, heating the magnetron but it's a common problem uh, you you have to uh, heat it but uh, with normal uh, transformer it's very problematic because uh, sometimes it's arcing uh, between pre primary and secondary so we specially made this transformer with reinforced uh, insulation so you can see the uh, controls uh, this is the temperature of the magnetron it's have not exceeded to 150 Celsius uh, 110 yes and the other is a power meter for the main supply uh, you can see also the fans and the heater transformers 44 watts but at full power it's thousand and a half uh, one and a half kilowatts mm -hmm.